Hey, what's going on, you guys? Your boy Chaim Samuels here, and, uh, notice anything different about me? But, no, not my shirt. I've had this shirt for a while. Come on. Something different about me? Just, I'll give you a hint. It's my glasses. Are you getting it? It's my glasses. Woo! Two grueling months. Just the most annoying experience, probably, of my adult life. It's just good to see you again. It feels good not to look like a homeless person. Speaking about annoyance, today we're going to tackle our favorite twin pranksters. You know them, you love them, the Delbury Brothers. Now, recently the... D what? Yeah, that's what I said. Yeah, the twins, you know, with the really annoying here. That's the Delbury Brothers. What, another? There's another pair of twins. Uh, okay, so apparently there's another set of twins that do pranks. The Strokes Brothers. Uh, they have an incredibly huge following. I don't, I don't know how I missed that. But anyways, recently the Strokes Brothers had some controversy when they were actually charged a felony for a prank that they did. And I'm not somebody who usually jumps on what everybody else is talking about, but I, I felt like I just had to jump on this. Pretty much the Strokes Brothers in October 2019 did a video where they pretended to rob a bank. So I wanted to take a look, just as so many other YouTubers have taken a look, and kind of throw my hat in the ring, and, and you know, just kind of give my thoughts on what I think about the whole thing. But before we get to that, guys, make sure to hit that subscribe button, follow me on all the other platforms. Also, I have merch. So if you're interested in really supporting my channel, you like my content, the best way to do it is go down, hit the link below. Me and my brother came up with uh, a bunch of cool different designs I think you guys will like. All right, guys, without further ado, Let's check this out. Hey guys, welcome back to another YouTube video. So, I'm Alan. And I'm Alex. And you might be wondering why we're dressed like this. I'm gonna say you weren't said no enough as a child, but that's just me. I don't know. It's because we're doing a bank robber prank. So we have a lot of money right here. We're gonna be running around in front of people and making it seem like we just got done robbing a bank. Excuse me? Do you know where the nearest uh, bank is at? Which kind? Uh, just like a bank where I can make like a large withdrawal, if you know what I mean. 200? No, I'm, I'm trying to make like a larger, larger like amount. You know how tight your security is or you don't? That's probably tight. That's okay. I'll just go find out myself. All right. Thank you. Hey man, I just, I just wanted to give you this because I would have never gotten all of this without your help. I'm good. You're man. good? No, like I, I definitely wouldn't have found it without your help. So you, you, you need, you need like a finders keepers? Really? This gentleman? Yeah. Can I, I, I need to get out of this outfit. Can I just buy that right off of you? No. I love that even though the Strokes twins are dressed up in all black and look like they're gonna rob a bank, this guy is still not scared of it. That's how much of a pretty boy YouTuber persona that these guys give off. Okay, man, I'm about to rob this bank. Don't tell anybody or else. <laughs> or else what? What? I'm just saying, or else what? Like, what, what are you gonna do? What do you mean, what am I gonna do? C come on, I, I got the whole thing going. Well, I, I mean... What? I'm just not scared. I mean, I got the whole thing going on. I'm, look, just because I'm not scared doesn't mean somebody else won't be scared. Look, that's just me, okay? Look, I just like my criminal a little scarier. I'm sure there's somebody out there that will be scared of you. You're just saying that. No, no, I mean it. Oh, okay. Rawr! Okay, but not me. Just stop. I, I thought I'd give it an extra try. I, I know what you were thinking, but just... I, I really gotta go now, right? These geniuses, they end up doing this prank and in the video they end up showing that they get into this uber 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 for alan and the uber yes. driver like it's all weird and out step on it like step on a gas okay can i just take this away just get off my coffee actually yeah no we're gonna get caught hey hey hold on you guys just get out of an uber a minute ago uh your videotape and stuff yeah yeah we were we like a public prank. we uh Come over here. You can close the door. A public prank that gets so about like... 15 police officers in the area hauling butt over here. Because so you guys I... are pulling up mass. <laughs> Here's the thing. I actually think this prank is kind of funny. There are bits and parts that I actually laughed at when I saw it. But I think why so many people are ridiculing these twins is because they have this persona. The quintessential, like, YouTuber. We've seen this with, like, a bunch of other YouTubers, like with Logan Paul, where they think they're just untouchable. And they just go and do all these extremes without thinking. And then... Finally, shit hits the fan. This could actually be a level of like a Sasha Baron Cohen prank or jackass. But with those types of people, they know the consequences. That's the thing. They're not being stupid about it. They would go into a situation like this knowing 
the consequences and probably doing the best not to get themselves in those bad situations or specifically getting themselves in the situation. But with these guys, there's it always feels like there's an entitlement. Like, they don't think that there will be any repercussions. And it's just this big-headedness, I think, why so many people just can't stand these types of YouTubers. What's your name? Uh, is it is it okay if I take you on a date sometime or? Uh, no. No. I'm sorry. Okay. Uh. Oh, you have a girlfriend? Okay. What about what about now? Oh, you're a lesbian? Well, how about some money? Will that change your mind? This is this is actually funny. I know I might be in the minority here, but this is this is actually really funny. I give him prop, even though it's stupid. To pull something off like this, it's ballsy. That it's ballsy. Uh, excuse me. Hey, uh, so uh, I'm new around here, and I was just wondering, real quick, could I maybe get your names or like your phone number or anything like that? No. Is it okay if I take one of you guys on a date sometime, or not even like? I could literally like buy you guys like anything. I just I could literally buy you guys anything. Not you. I'm good. You're good. Okay. Oh, really? Okay, well, in that case, it's okay if you guys say no, but I just, I'm gonna go rob another bank, and I just need, like, two attractive females to, like, no. distract the security guards. I can, like, provide you guys, like, with outfits and stuff. No? no. Not even, not even if I give you guys some money for, no. for the help? Do you guys know where, like, the nearest bank is at? No. Or, no? You guys don't? This normally works, like... These guys are really trying hard to pick up women. Like, something tells me that they're actually being genuine. Like, hey, so, uh, I'm about to rob a bank, but maybe afterwards we can grab some coffee? Oh, absolutely no? <laughs> Hold on to that. Would money change your mind? That usually works with the regular girls I pick up. Is it the mask? Is, is that really trying to go off? It's the mask, isn't it? Every time I whip out money for girls, they immediately want to date me, so I don't... I can take it off if you... Oh, it's my... Oh, it's my personality. Oh, I didn't... Did not see that coming. But yeah, I mean, this is this is a funny ass prank. I'm not gonna lie. I really got some good laughs out of this. But again, as I said before, I think just the bulk of ridicule that's coming after specifically these guys, it just shows the stupidity and I think sometimes the self-importance of a lot of these YouTubers. But they think they're just untouchable. They can kind of do whatever they want, and there will, won't be any consequences. And I think the Strokes brothers found out pretty quickly. That that is not the case. I don't know, guys. That's my thoughts. Thank you guys so much for watching. Really appreciate it. Again, hit that subscribe button if you enjoy my content. Always coming out with new sketches. Enjoy the rest of your day, you guys. Because you deserve.